Welcome to Realm of Friends, the official episode number one. If you're a little bit confused by episode zero, that's because I just wanted to go ahead and put an episode out there. Because we're going to turn this thing into a subsequential series so that people can follow the story. Um, so yes, this is officially episode one, even though we have been playing for a little while. As you can see, the shenanigans are, are well in effect. Those aren't my chickens. Although I suppose they are. I, I think I've inherited it, a bunch of chickens. We have the Mushroom Kingdom across the way, uh, owned by Sudo. Biggie over there and uh, Christ Crusader's castles through those trees. And then uh, we started a dragon egg game. As you know, there's only one dragon egg in Minecraft. So uh, we did hide and seek before. And if Christ Crusader could find Biggie, he got the egg and he found her. And now he has set up a game for us. And I'm not going to go look at that just yet. But stay tuned because we're going to save that for towards the end on um, the dragon egg the plan was to work on the pit shaft but um for now i'm gonna figure out what to do with the thousand chickens in my house a thousand golems in my backyard and this is the other part oh okay he just relocated them all well at least they're no longer in the lake wow i can't imagine how much work that took to relocate all those chickens let's let's fly over there and see what's going on uh near the castle Okay, we're gonna have to leave him a little gift, if you know what I mean. See, my first inclination is to set TNT up underneath his trap door here, uh, but I don't, I don't want to do any real harm to your base, so I'm obviously not gonna do that. I mean, I think I'll have to do the prank off off stream because otherwise, you're gonna get a sneaky peek at what I'm gonna do. But uh, for now, I'm just gonna internalize all of my ideas. I was just gonna fill your castle up with chickens, but you beat me to the punch so i don't know what to what to do I, uh, that would just feel like i'm copying you at this point i'm not particularly mad about it because it's kind of epic having this many iron golems the chickens are a completely different story this is just ridiculous so let's go ahead let's go ahead and take a look at this uh challenge because if it has to deal with moving the chickens <laughs> we might need to jump on this right away Save Vezion from Nightmare by relocating all the chickens inside his house. <laughs> Alright, so I can save myself from my own nightmare. Or I can sit here and wait patiently for someone to do the work for me. I won't get the dragon egg out of it, but at least I'll get the chickens out of my base. What do I want to do? Do I want to spend my time working on my pit shaft and have someone else clear my house out for me? Or do I want to clear it out and obtain the dragon egg? I say you get a fox, a pet fox, and put it in your home. I know where I can find a pet fox at. All right. <laughs> oh, <no. laughs> How does one uh, relocate foxes in Minecraft? Leads? Aha. Uh -huh. Oh, gosh. I don't even want to go in there. I'm not even sure that I have any leads here. Oh, my here. goodness. I mean, all good on the top. <laughs> Isn't it ridiculous? Oh, and look at my bedroom. That's what I that's what I woke up to. Yeah, I'm a big fan of chickens. Uh, let's see. Slime. Yep, yeah, perfect. <laughs> I'm doing my best just to focus. Oop. Okay. Oh. Well, looks like we're walking to suit uh to Christ Crusaders. Your fox will not return home the same way it left. <laughs> Although I feel I have a feeling it's really going to enjoy itself visiting um, my little cottage. My babysitting services uh, are going to come with a fee, by the way. All right, Mr. Fox. Let's figure out what you say. All right, right this way, buddy. I hope I don't kill your fox. Don't get in the lava. If he gets in the lava, it's his own fault. Come on. What is happening? No! No! What what happened? <gasps> He's getting away! Come here! Come here! Come here! No! Come here, buddy. Come here. He doesn't come to the berries. Who said he comes to the berries? Oh, he's going to sleep. He's going to sleep. Shh. I got him. Alright, so let's go this way, buddy. I'll try to walk a little bit slower for you this time. No, no, no. This way. This way. Come on. Come on, dude. Come on, Reggie. There we go. Good boy. Come on, Reginald. I've got a really good surprise for you. You're going to love staying at my place. Come on, buddy. Look, we're almost there. You're almost in chicken heaven. 
You're almost in chicken heaven, dude. Come on. Dude, if you only knew what was waiting for you around the corner, you wouldn't go chasing after these girls. Come on, buddy. Come on, Reginald. No, 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 this is a nightmare. This is a nightmare. This is a nightmare. No! Reggie! Reggie! Yes. Fight the chickens. Fight the chickens, Reggie. Fight the chickens till you get tired, Reggie. Oh, gosh. Why does it have to be nighttime? Biggie, can you sleep? Sleep, please! Oh, okay. All right. I got him on the lead, but now I have to fight a chicken. Oh, yes. Oh, sweet daylight. You might have just saved Reginald's life. Come on. Oh, no, 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 no. No. <laughs> come, come on. Where'd you go? Where'd you go? He, like, goes gone. Oh. <laughs> come on. Reginald, why can't you just come this way? I've got chickens for you. Come on. Yeah, you go. Oh, should I have had the berries out this whole time? Come on. Look, look, go get them. Go get them. Go get them. Oh, no. Oh, no, they're all falling out. Reginald, you're supposed to get in the house. What are you doing up there? Come on, let's go. Let's go. Get in the house. Get in the house. Yes. Close the door. No. Reginald, look at all the chickens. There you go. Good boy. <laughs> we did it. We did it. Yeah! Yay! <laughs> he is hungry. He is killing some of these chickens. All right, we'll just let him do his thing for a little while. Once he's done doing his thing, I win the dragon egg. And we're gonna go into our pit shaft and work on it. Do you pronounce it caramel or caramel? It's always a, an argument point among people. Some people say caramel, some people say caramel um and you know they always get in fights with each other but i'm definitely partial to putting cream on my uh ice cream i love that there's so much division amongst people with that uh i think there's a lot of different words that people pronounce different ways but they don't really care it's like oh yeah i say massage you say massage but um we're not gonna start a civil war over it. but caramel and cream people really freak out over i feel like if i'm talking like in regular like sentencing i would probably say caramel um but like if i'm at somewhere and trying to order it, i want to make sure i pronounce it right so i'd be like hey can i get uh some vanilla ice cream with some caramel and hot fudge <laughs> could you imagine though <laughs> i really want to do that next time i'm getting ice cream <laughs> like i get some caramel <laughs> like what my friend luke orders puppy chow at dairy queen who's ever heard of puppy chow i'm probably alone in that but Apparently, puppy chow is an ice cream flavor. I don't feel comfortable ordering myself something called puppy chow. Yeah, apparently it's a Dairy Queen thing. And, like, he straight up went to the Dairy Queen, went to the counter and said, Can I get some puppy chow? And they knew what he was talking about. I asked him if that's what it's called on the menu because I didn't see it up there on the menu. But he said, Yeah, that's what it's called. And I was like, If I ran my own business, I don't think I would ever call something puppy chow. Unless I ran a dog business. Then, then I'll probably call things puppy chow. This is this is really just truly a, a, an ice cream advertisement. This is the longest ice cream commercial ever. It's also a commercial for why you should own a pet fox. And it's a commercial for caramel sauce. Oh. I just broke my diamond pig. <laughs> I think I have more diamonds at home. I hadn't really thought of this through. I've not really actually prepared myself for... For digging. <laughs> Why'd you look at me when you did it? I needed comfort. <laughs> oh, let's see how the murder fest is going on in the house. Did Reginald fall asleep? There's still a lot of chickens in here. Oh, yeah, he's still at it. Keep up the good work, Reginald. You're doing a fantastic job. I can see the floor. I can see the floor now. Yes! Let's go, Reginald. But I'm very happy with this method. Cause I don't have to be the one to kill these poor chickens. I can just let the fox do it for me. I don't know which one's arguably more morbid. Okay, I only have three more diamonds. So what that means, I don't need to use those three diamonds to build my pit shaft. 
I need to use those three diamonds for diamond for mining for more diamonds. But the problem is I don't have a mine shaft to do so with. Hmm. Welp, time for me to go earn some diamonds. Cobblestone here! Get your cobblestone here! <laughs> chicken eggs! I'm opening up a chicken egg shop. Who wants to buy an egg? Hey there. What's up? Do you want to buy some eggs? Um, not really. Do you know how expensive eggs are these days? They're charging four dollars a diamond. I mean, four diamonds an egg what? down at the supermarket. Here, but, I'll give you. Wait, I don't have any on me. But if I oh, you, I see you are already taken care of. <laughs> okay, excuse me, sir. Would you like to buy an egg? He's scary. I'm gonna go ahead and retrieve my uh, dragon egg because I think I think I've deserved it. You gotta get rid of the chickens. Bro. Oh gosh. Okay, fine. I'm. Not, you're right. I'm not technically saved yet. Uh, open your doors and let them run free. No, then we'll have an even bigger problem on our hands. <laughs> At least they're contained right, right now. Just All right, make, Reg make Reginald. Make a uh, lava pool outside your door. And let them free. How awful! <laughs> You're totally right. I'm not. My house technically has not been saved yet because I'm still afraid to go inside. Oh my goodness! <laughs> scared me. So, therefore, I can't get the egg. But this has been a lot of fun, nonetheless. Thanks for tuning in. Thanks for watching. And we'll see you next time in Episode 2 of Realm of Friends. Be sure to uh, keep an eye on the YouTube channel because, like I said, I'm going to be making a prank for Christ Crusader and for Sudo. But I'm going to have to do, that, do all of that off camera um, so that they can't get any, um, you know, sneak peeks. But, yep, yeah, this has been fun. Bye-bye!